to turn this on. There it is. Now the question is, can I turn up the brightness? Where's that palette gonna be? Oh no, okay. Real quick. Uh, let me mute my mic on my fucking controller. Question is, how do I pull this up? Is this is it actually broken? Shoot, I may just have to play from my. <laughs> also, thank you for the biddies, Everett. How you doing, man? It's been forever since I've seen you. Why is it not? Shoot. See, I have. Audio. There we go. So I need to change the stuff, but this game is called Lion Prince and the Liar Princess. It's a really interesting game, uh, and I've been looking forward to playing it forever, but I didn't have a system that could play it because it was on like PS Vita for a while, and now it's actually real. Uh, all right. Change this real quick. Ah, but I've been looking forward to this game forever, to be honest. Uh, now, if I can pull it up so I can actually see it in full view, otherwise I have to play it from the viewing screen of my uh, my really weird like, little half heart thing. Uh, can I? How do I do this? <laughs> See, I should... Here we are. Okay. This actually works. Oh, wait, shoot. Ah, I should be playing with my actual controller, but I only have my... I only have these. Music isn't too loud, is it? Oh, wait. Did I... Why can I not... Select. Or is it... Let me select. Oh wait, oh, because I hit continue, that's why. And I don't have anything. New game. Okay, select a bookmark. Okay, cool. That's why. Weird that it lets you even do that if you don't have any save files. But it's a very charming looking game, I think, at least in my opinion. This is a tiny tale of love in a faraway land. Is the audio messing up a bit? Wait, it fixed itself? Question mark? Once upon a time, I'm, there was a kingdom surrounded by a deep, dark forest. The forest was a frightening place, filled with beasts and ruled by a powerful witch. Even during the day, the forest could be as dark as the winter. 
Because of this, humans rarely ventured inside. As terrible as the forest was, a beautiful singing voice would always pierce the darkness when the moon shone. The voice belonged to a large wolf. She would proudly sing towards the moon, top cliff, every night. Okay, and honestly what attracts me to this game is the art style alone is fantastic. The wolf singing drew in an unforeseen and my a human prince of the kingdom, surrounded by the forest. Every night, the prince would venture into the fairy forest just to hear the beautiful song. Game's got an excellent art style. One night, when the wolf finished singing, the prince plotted. The voice's identity was hidden because of the cliff, but this only piqued the prince's curiosity. The wolf glanced at the prince. Wolves are man eaters. After all, what stupid prey, she thought. I should eat him, now that I'm fi finished singing. However, the prince had innocently plotted the wolf, who had never before been praised for her song, her singing. She hesitated at first, but for some reason, she soon grew fond of it and didn't feel like eating. For several more nights, the wolf sang her song, always looking forward to the prince's applause. But the wolf thought, if he finds out that I'm a monster, he'll get scared and he won't come listen to me sing anymore. Fortunately, I gotta play this with split Joy-Cons, which is a little annoying because I don't remember where I put the spider. So every night after her song, the wolf would hear the Prince of Boss and retreat into the deep, dark forest. I said a friend quest. Ah, oh, cool. On what exactly? Uh, these nights continued even as the seasons changed. On a night like any other, the wolf sang her song toward the moon. It was the same quiet evening for her. I'm surprised they haven't shown the song yet because the song's really good. However, the night was a special night. For the prince, he entered the forest, filled with determination. This is an Undertale reference. <laughs> this is an Undertale fan game. Uh, he wanted to see the identity of the singing voice with his own two eyes. Prince climbed the cliff. It's heart full. Wolf didn't notice anything unusual at first, but when she was done singing, she didn't hear the applause that always came afterward. She pondered and wondered and glanced down below. What? Why was the prince coming so close to her? He'll hate me if he sees me. The wolf panicked. No one should see what I really look like. She extended a large paw to cover the prince's eyes. But it turned out to be a real slash, right? But instead, her claws accidentally tore the prince's eyes. The wounded prince slipped from the cliff. The startled wolf, though, thought, the human falls from this height. It hurriedly seized the prince's arm. 
At the same time, the terrified prince felt the same beastly presence on his arm as the one that had scratched out his eyes, which increased his dread tenfold. The prince screamed and struggled desperate to escape the wolf's clutches. Alarmed by his yells, uh, accidentally let his arm slip through her grasp. Or the wolf alarmed by his yells. Okay, my bad, I read the wrong part fast. The prince plummeted down the cliff. But then, thump, he landed safe on some brush bushes. He was not harmed from the fall. The wolf's claws had injured his eyes. A nearby soldier from the kingdom rushed over to the prince. The soldier had heard his screams and had come to see the commotion. The prince must have been hurt by a monster up above. The soldiers quickly fired some arrows. The wolf was concerned about the prince, but after being barraged by arrows, she was forced to escape into the forest. The wounded prince began to gradually lose consciousness. The terrible memory of claws in his eyes and the beast grip on his arms became engraved in his mind. Several nights later, the prince, now blind, had brought disappointment and shame to the royal family. He had Xbox? No, I don't. Uh, family, and his parents locked him away in the castle tower. Uh, I'm a, I'm a Sony guy. I, I, I haven't gotten anything new, though. The wolf was concerned about the prince and overheard some soldiers in the castle say that he had been locked away that's awful she thought angrily and she snuck into the tower to check on it cool i get a move now dude the art style in this game is so good also who am i i'm wolf dash dancing homie oh wait i can crouch or is that just Why to attack? Can I jump at least? Dude, I'm just killing people now. I need my prince. Get away from me. Who are you even, skank? I just want my boy. I can jump. Huh? This, this small obstacle will surely get in his way. <laughs> Death to you. Loss. The door will open if you touch it, if you have a key. I'm assuming he dropped a key and I didn't see it. Ah. Uh, get away from my mans. The wolf came across a cold room and saw the distressed prince sitting inside. Prince sensed someone nearby and raised his face. A large cloth was wrapped around his eyes as if to hide something shameful and dirty. Prince, the wolf said uncertainly. That voice, the singer in the forest, the prince said. He can recognize me by my voice, the wolf thought. Wait, the wolf is talking like this? Um, yeah, that's right. The wolf responded. I was attacked by a monster in the forest, the prince said. But I'm glad you're alright. 
The prince smiled a bit with relief. The wolf felt her chest ache when she looked at his ragged figure. Poor boy. Thank you for coming. But how did you know I was here? The wolf didn't know how to respond to that question. Wait, you can say the same thing. I overheard someone. I... I'm a princess from a kingdom. Uh, the wolf lied, remembering that the prince couldn't see her. I said I wanted to visit the ill prince and they let me in. Anyway, forget that. I can't believe that you're trapped in here. But I, I was attacked by a vicious monster and my face is awful. My vision is gone. I can't wander outside. I'm forbidden from showing my face in public ever again. The prince said, his head hanging sadly. Let's ask the witch of the forest to heal your eyes. The prince looked dumbfounded upon hearing her idea. The witch? You mean the witch of the forest? Like the one from the storybook? Storybook? I'm not sure, but the witch can grant all wishes. She can fix you. The witch lives deep inside the forest. I could take you there. The wolf was excited at the prospect, but the prince's head continued hanging. It'd be hard to take me deep inside the forest. And the monster that rendered me blind, I can still feel its claws on me. The prince couldn't continue. His shoulders trembling. The wolf dropped her gaze after hearing his words. She looked at her paws. All she saw were sharp claws that were made for hurting others. I mean, I killed at least five guys on the way here, so yeah, it makes sense. I want to take the prince from here, the wolf thought. But I can't hold his hands with these monstrous claws. Determined, she clasped her paws quietly and stepped closer to the prince. I'll take you to the forest to see the witch. The prince slowly raised his head to the wolf's voice. But just wait here a bit. We'll be back shortly. She, she then fled from the castle tower and ran into the forest. All right, cool. Chapter one or something like that. She ran all night through the forest. The sun was rising just as she arrived at the witch's house. The witch of the forest turned her gaze to the sudden visitor. Oh, what a rare customer! A man-eating wolf coming all the way here! What's this about? I wish to become human. There's someone I want to see. The witch let out a hearty laugh. Sly wolves rarely said such things. A man-eating wolf become a human. How amusing. But why on earth? N never mind. No need to divulge the details. I believe I already know. Why? Wolf growled at the witch. Which is mockery. Witch prodded the wolf's nose, the latter looking ready to bite at any time. But of course I shall grant your wish. Hmm, but you do know what I need, yes? Strange glowing spheres around appeared out of nowhere. The witch pulled one to her side, admiring it. Beautiful, each one differs from others. All unique gems. The spheres vivid glow pulsed in the witch's palm. The witch was a collector with a rare, rather crude temperament. In return for granting wishes, she took the request most cherished possession and turned them into crystals. The most beautiful hearts are the ones willing to lose what's important to them in order to get what they want. So what will your heart reveal to you? The witch peered into the wolf's heart eyes as if to discern a suitable payment. Mm, yes, how about your compensation? Singing voice as compensation. My singing voice. The wolf knew that the witch had a wicked streak, and she knew she had to sacrifice the most important thing to her. So her heart trembled in doubt. A beautiful singing voice that the prince praised, or the chance to hold her in his hand. Okay, I'll give you my singing voice. In exchange, the mouth of the witch's mask curled up, as if giving an evil grin. 
Excellent payment accepted. I didn't expect to get this from one so prideful, but I suppose life is full of surprises. Well, I'm in good mood, so I'll give you a little something extra, in which his eyes twinkled dubiously. I'll give you whatever you form you desire. What do you want? The wolf remembered what she told the prince. I want to look like a princess. The witch chuckled softly at the wolf's choice. My, my. What a lovely idea. But you're sure of that? You and your human friend will be devoured by monsters before you even get here. The wolf was unnerved and hung her head, ashamed that the witch had seen how futile the plan was. Didn't think about that, did you? Hmm. Even closer wolves can be dull sometimes. Modify the spell so you can return to wolf form at any time. Magical light appeared as she began the ritual. The magical light wrapped around the wolf's body. Part of the light gathered near the witch. I've received your singing voice as the toll. The witch said with an eerie smile. Light ahead. Around the wolf suddenly shone bright and then faded. But I'm still a wolf. The wolf looked sad and disappointed. It's a complex spell, the witch said. Give your body some time, you'll get used to it. Her task complete, the wolf departed the house. However, the witch stopped her in her tracks. Ah, I almost forgot. Beware of the moonlight. Yes. If you fall under it, you will immediately turn back into a wolf. Okay, thank you. Soon I'll be human and hold the prince's hand. I'm so excited, full of hope, the wolf eagerly anticipating, anticipated returning to the castle tower. The prince was waiting. After leaving the wolf's house, the wolf made the journey back to the castle tower. She recalled the wolf's words about turning into a princess. It had already been one night. The prince was in sight. The wolf focused on transforming into the princess. Next to transform, she looks so cute. And then I can turn back like that. Can I attack like this? No. She's so adorable. The princess, the princess called out to the prince. Prince, princess, you came back. Thank you. But don't worry, I worked hard to be able to let you out. The prince said brightly, trying to ease the prince. Ah, uh, they're so adorable. All right, she thought. I have to get him out of the cell. I can destroy the bars as a wolf, but the prince needs to get away from them first. Um, could you step back a little? Oh, okay. Despite the prince's confusion, at her instructions, he stepped back from the bars. Alright, nice. Alright, take the prince's hand by using Y. Ah, the princess timidly grasped the prince's tiny warm hand. Though he was scared, he weakly grasped her his back. I gave up my singing voice to be human, she thought, feeling joyful, but I'm glad I did. Let's go to the Witch of the Forest. Make sure you stay close to me, okay? Uh, real quick. Anything I can do with the bear? No? Come on, let's go. Oh, I have to hold it. Come on, buddy. Ah, uh, they're adorable. They entered the deadly forest to travel to the witch's house and heal the prince. And so, the journey finally began. I finally got myself Pokemon Snap, too. Alright, let's go. Ooh. That's a lot of story, but I love it still. Right, can I step on this uh, thing? What happens if I try to hold his hand like this? No, I, okay, I can't even do that. Interesting. Let's go, Princey. Die, vile beast. No one steps in front of me and my man. 
No one gets in our way. The perfect power couple. I wonder if he hears the slashing at all, and is like, um, is that you, babe? Or is that, like, something else I should be concerned about? Because I am blind and can't see this perceived threat. Come on, let's go. Here, boy. <laughs> here, boy, come on. Uh, ooh, what's under here? What's this thing? Is that a checkpoint? I need to take him deeper or something? Is that like a checkpoint thing? I have no idea. Oh, the music in this game is so good so far. Let's go under. Uh, I wonder what's above now. Uh, okay, Princey, you stay here. I'm gonna go off for a second. I can jump higher like this. Uh, yeah, I can't even explore this area with him. Oh, I'm collecting those leaves. Okay, I didn't even realize that. Interesting. So collect, like, the nice yellow leaves as well. Got it. Do these things fight back? Die. Fledgling hunter. I shall become a hunter for my prince. My boy toy. My man. To whom I love very much. Dun 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 dun. Alright, let's see. Alright. So first puzzle. Get this to move by pressing A. Wait, what is A in this sense? Uh, oh wait, I have to use the princess form to do it. Oh, whoops. Come on, Princey. Interesting. Okay, so I can operate mechanisms with the prince, but er, with the princess, but not thing. Would a witch princess be a witchess? Hmm. I think they'd still be a princess. I just think, like I think it would follow like almost Adventure Time logic, where it's like not lumpy space princess kind of deal, but like witch princess. Or just a princess who has witch abilities. Come on, hurry. Uh, I love this man so much. Okay, wait. Stand on here, babe. I'm gonna go deal with some things right now. Uh, anything over here? No? Alright. I gotta get you. Alright. Interesting concept, though. I, I do like... Hmm. Actually, it'd be more like Zelda, almost. Zelda's almost witchy. What, the three people stand up? <laughs> the wolf weighs us the same as two people. Are you calling me fat? I don't take kindly to that, babe. They weigh as much as two people, apparently. I'm thicky, but, like... The prince doesn't need to know that. Okay, wait. Can I just drag him on as, like, the princess? Come on. Why- why can't he go? Uh, wait. This isn't lifting him up at all, is it? No, it is. So the question is... Wait, what? Ah, oh, dang it. Okay, maybe he's too close and that's the problem. Mm. Come on. Oh, no, yeah, okay, he was too close. Ah. Uh, okay, I can kind of trip and fall as the princess as well. What does this do? Oh, wait. So I'm assuming we both gotta step on these together. Come on, babe. Uh. Okay, wait. So. Oh, wait, does this just activate it permanently? Mm -mm -mm -mm. Alright, nothing's over there. Let me mess with this. I was gonna say you're calling fat, but you beat me to it. Yeah. <laughs> I don't like I don't like what this game's insinuating about me. My weight. Listen, I'm a wolf. I've got a glandular problem or something. 
Oh wait, okay. Wait, babe, come over here real quick. For like a hot second. There we are. Chest. Okay, break the chest as a wolf. Gotcha. Uh, anything cool up here? Ooh. What's up this way? Interesting. I wish I could go on all fours for the- Ooh! Ah, uh, shoot. Ouch. Ah, oh, She's got a cute dying animation too, though. I will say that. She's just adorable. She's just adorable. Like, peak- Peak character design, I think. Uh, alright. Uh, this- Legitimately, like, I, I'm in love with this art style. I can't- I, I'm gushing about it too much, but I think it's so good. It, it's effective communication, it's got a nice aesthetic to it. Okay, wait. Get up. Oh, uh, no. Oh, dang it. Hmm. I need a- I need to transform or move out of the way fast enough. Is that audio? Are you guys hearing that like weird little buzz for the audio kind of deal? So that's uh, that's the issue I gotta fix eventually. Okay, so it won't let me transform whenever I'm in close quarters like that. I hope it's not that bothersome. It's like a little static -y or something, but it shouldn't be that bad, right? Uh, okay, wait, can I try and kill him here? Nope, okay. Uh, so, one last time. I can actually transform in the air, probably. Can I- do I only die in one hit, though? Is that, like, even in the wolf form? I should be cautious about that? Or is that something I have to come back to? I got KFC. Nice. Chicken. Always a good choice. I'm not a KFC guy, but I, I, I get the fried chicken sentiment. Dude, I can't wait to get the KFC gaming console. I want to be their first sponsored gamer. Maybe I have to play their dating sim in order to do that. Um, ooh, ooh. Wait, is it gonna come back? And if so... Okay, cool, cool, cool. I got it, I got it. Ooh, finally. Okay, yeah, so I was supposed to do that. Because I couldn't kill it any other way. Choo. Oh, dang it. Wolf form. I'm a sexy mofo. And all you hoes jealous of my swagger. Da, 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 da. Okay, come on, buddy. Ah, uh, we're adorable. Just, just too, just too pure for this world. I did admittedly claw out his eyes, uh, which was a, a bit of a hiccup in our relationship, but I think he's getting over it. <laughs> they talked to each other during their journey. She mentioned uh, that she enjoyed running around, and he confided that he liked reading. Have you ever smelled something and then tasted it in the future? No, yeah, all the time. I love books about flowers, it said the princess. I can't uh, leave the castle that often, so I thought it'd be nice to see, finally see flowers in the outside world while they were talking. There was a rustling sound. A small monster appeared from the bushes and leapt toward the prince. The princess had barely escaped being bitten by the monster. The princess quickly transformed into the wolf and brushed away the monster. Eventually, everything happened so fast and for the prince he could not see what was going on. He crouched down on the spot shaking fear. He couldn't help it. He'd recently had a scary experience in the forest. I wonder what was that all about. I love how you taste, how it tastes tobacco and the mashed potatoes, corn chicken, really? The wolf panicked. I've got to do something. But she had no idea what to do for the frightening prince. Sing it. She desperately glanced around. A beautiful flower field caught her eye. 
She da she looked at it and remembered what the prince had said. Of course, I can give him flowers. Aww. Uh, I get that with dessert a lot, though. Sweets and all that. Uh, oh, I guess I gotta grab it on my own. Just pick it as a wolf. Oh, wait, I need, I need to be the princess to do that. All right, let's go. My prince, for you, a rose. Or, I think this is almost a sunflower. Approach the prince and give him a gift. Hey, babe. Mm. Prince, this is for you. The princess handed a flower to the prince. A flower? It smells so nice. Yeah, you said you love books about flowers. The prince smiled happily at the princess's words. If only he knew I clawed out his eyes. Thank you. I wonder what kind of flower it is. I can't see it, though, but I'm more excited to see it once my eyes are healed. She was just relieved to see him happier. Shouldn't the prince be handing the flower? Eh, true, but... I mean, he's blind in this case. I don't think he even knows where the flowers were. I want to thank you. I know. Do you read a lot of books? Want to hear a story I read one time? <laughs> the princess didn't expect the prince to be so happy. She felt like she was already becoming closer to him. I'll pick more flowers when I see another flower field. Prince thought. Or princess thought, smiling. <sighs> it's a toxic relationship, but it's our relationship. I love the idea of it <laughs> being slightly toxic. Oh no. Come on. Prince, Prince, we gotta get out of here. Alright, let me handle this, babe. Let me handle this. I got it. I got it. No, get back here. Get back here, you cheating son of a... Alright, come on, babe, I got you. Uh, how's it feel to be blind? How does it... How does it feel? You can tell me, babe. You can be honest. We can't go under there. We can't be crushed. Ooh, thank you for the level 4, Andrew. Uh, question. Wait. Do I get stats? Uh, collection. Oh, that's so cool! Wait, we actually get design motifs. Oh, I love that. Slight jump over here. Let's see, collect this little gem. Now, the question is, how do we get higher? Oh no. <laughs> oh, he died. Oh, he died at that height. Oh, I am so sorry, Prince Babe. Ouch. That hurt our knees. We scraped them. Alright. Oh, that was... <laughs> oh. I killed him. I killed him with my love. Well, maybe not with my love, with fall fall height. I killed him with, a, with gravity. Alright, hopefully that little leaf we have to the, like, the left of us is still collected. Dun, 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 dun. This reminds me of another game I remember having as a kid. I remember getting it at Costco. I can't remember what the DS game was called, but it was one where we got... You, you had to collect these, like, babies or something like that. I can't remember what it was called. I, I have fond memories of it somewhat. Even if you... Even on a collapsing... Ooh. Oh, shoot. Uh... So... I'm just gonna kill you right here and now, buddy. You don't deserve to live. Eh? Nope, you're not getting back on. <laughs> Aw, we're sharing a little ride together. Alright, let's see. Let's head up. Maybe I get a crouching damage attack? How do I get up here? Oh wait, no, it's the princess. Right, this is her like little deal. Okay, I'm gonna go do some exploring, babe. Hold on a second. And then I saw something over here. Alright, I think that's it. Doot, doot. Babe, you're still there, right? Nothing's eating you. Oh, thank goodness. 
Honey bunny, come on. <laughs> Listen, I know I'm thicky, but like, stop insulting it for me. I've got a glandular problem again. It's not my fault. It's not my fault if you can't handle all this meat. Arby's. We have the beefs. Come on. Babe, come on. Babe. Babe, don't embarrass me right now. Babe. Babe, this better not switch us over. Babe. Babe. Say something to me. How do I know if you don't- how do I know you're not cheating on me if you don't tell me every five seconds? <laughs> Babe, you still love me, right? Oh, oh, oh! It's an army! I'm gonna kill them all! Dude. Just slaughter them. You all deserved it. You had it coming. You shouldn't have gotten in my way. It's my- it's your fault. Come on. Grab, grab, babe, babe, grab my hand. We're going. I don't want to be at this party anymore. Uh, let's see. Oh, no other secrets. Got. I think we're pretty good on the secrets for so far. All right, let's move. The footing might break with two people on it. Hold the prince's hand and ask him to walk. With this. Can you walk? How do I select? I just select. Can you walk forward, babe? Okay, good. This still doesn't count as two people. Interesting. So we give him commands, too. No, oh, oops. First, deal with this skank. And then we raise, we raise my baby up. This is high enough, right? We can jump. Very good athletes. Dun dun dun. I can make it. Thank goodness I can make it. I didn't want my baby dying. Alright. Okay, wait, can I not be damaged by these things? If so, uh, it's a little weird. Uh, other than the fact that they just present a threat to, like, hubby, but... Go forward again, babe. Step. Ooh, wait. Forgot. Two people. Bad move. Should almost killed us. Alright, what's up here? I'm just one of these. Actually. Pretty sure. Okay, wait, just transform back. make sure he doesn't get in the way. Listen, I can't help it. I'm jealous of anyone who steals him from me. No, okay, that does nothing. Alright, uh, go to the edge here. Start walking, buddy. Alright, next we go. Dun, 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 dun. Uh, let's see. Ouch. Oh wait, it's a two... I think that means only three people can stand on it? And that's just enough weight for the wolf. Ooh, and free thing. Alright, come on, babe. Yeah, all three of us have to be on here. Well, two planks can support my weight at least. I guess that is because it distributes for like... Wait, no. That's still- if two people break it, and then there's two, I count as two people. Okay, yeah, no, actually, the math works out. I wonder if we get any other people to follow us. Then... Can we get crushed here? I mean, I, won't, I kinda wanna try to see if we can. And again, I don't know how much progress is like within that one area. <coughs> Ooh, bless me. Dun dun dun. Cut it in half. Ooh, another flower. Here. I'll bring one to 
It looks like a honeysuckle or like an orchid little thing. Alright, come on. Ouch. Here you are. Alright, come on. Let's move. Uh, did we kill ourselves? Yeah, okay. <laughs> I didn't know what I expected there. Uh, alright, so it's this. I have to ask him to step on it by himself. Alright, babe. You got this. Just, uh... I have to make him trip and fall? Oh god. I am heartless. Ouch. Oh, wait, no, that was a lethal fall. <laughs> okay, I gotta be in the wolf form for that, then, I guess. Oh, whoops. Push. Alright. As the wolf, though, I'm nigh invincible, right? Yeah. Oh. And then did a new platform come up? Oh, cool, cool. Ah, the puzzles in this game are kind of cool. I don't want to give him all the flowers I possibly can, because I love him. They walked for what seemed like an eternity, and didn't notice how dark it had gotten. Both of them were exhausted from the dangers of the forest. But as their bellies began to rumble, they found a place they could take a rest. Let's stop here for a bit, said the princess, and she started preparing dinner. Ta-da! She... princess took out some meat, her favorite food. Go on, take a bite! It's raw. She then offered the bloody meat to the prince. I'm sure the prince will like it too, the princess thought, smiling. Uh, what's happening with her dress? Thank you, the prince put the meat in his mouth and tilted his head in confusion. Um, this tastes odd. It's fresh rabbit meat! It's yummy, isn't it? The princess said proudly. <laughs> I caught it myself. Oh, I want to hold her. Wait, this is raw meat? The prince coughed and promptly spat it back out. The princess, who thought he would enjoy it, looked at him with a blank expression on her face. Honey, we don't eat- humans don't eat raw- uh, Sorry, we don't eat raw meat at the castle. The princess felt bad for the prince. Oh, really? So how do you eat meat? Well, we first cook it over the fire. You get sick if it's eaten rotten. Raw. The princess probe at the word fire? Oh, you used that. She was afraid of it and became tense just from thinking about it. So she doesn't like fire, huh? I, uh, I'll go find some fruit instead. And with that, the princess managed to avoid further discussion of fire with the prince. She's so adorable. I just want to protect her. Alright, come on. Let's get some fruit. Wait, do you imitate me now? Oh, wait, no, is that because I... Interesting. Oh, hello, weird new creature. I'm gonna kill you, too. Uh, what is that thing? It's like a combination of a snake and a frog. Yeah, it's like a snake and a frog. Uh, I don't know what's going on with its tongue. Air defense. Get dunked on, fool. Bunny hop all the way to the exit. Ooh, okay, and we've got raising and lowering platforms now. This is such a uh, stunning game to look at. Okay, wait. Uh, oh, wait, okay, so you stay here, honey. I'm gonna do this. Does it actually stop somewhere? Okay, cool. Lower this. Whoops. I forget A button is, like... It's so weird for me. Oh, right, Lethal Falls, I forgot that was- I keep forgetting those are a thing for her in her human form, and I suppose that would make sense. Oh dang it, we started at the beginning. Or, wait, they also have wings, are they like flies too? Oh, whoops, I left Hubby behind. Come on. 
Do do do. All right, kill like the horde over here. Yeah, they've got like wings and like almost bat wings kind of tendencies. Seems. I don't know how to describe it. They just look weird. Also, do I run normally through those things if I'm like you know not monstrous? Uh, okay. So here we are, first puzzle again. Uh, head over here, Princey. Alright. I'll step on this. Pop up here. And shoot. Easy enough. Oh, wait. Uh, lethal fall. Oh, wait, no. It wasn't lethal this time. For some reason. Alright. Cool. Bounce pads. Nice. Oh, no. One. Ouch. We're not doing them any favors. <laughs> we just keep falling flat on their face. Mm. No secrets so far. Cut them in half. Dun dun. Let's see. Can you get onto here? Alright, let's see about over here real quick. Wait, does it work for me too? Okay, it does. Quickly get these. <laughs> I wonder, how does he not know I'm here whenever I'm like next to him in wolf form? Like, I felt like there should be like a, a range thing that he knows clearly that I am in my wolf form. Wait, can I, uh. Oh. What happens if I try to slash near him? Nothing. I'm not going for his eyes anymore. Alright, whatever this puzzle is. Uh. No. Alright, come on. Wait, what? Oh no, I did this terribly wrong. Uh, how do I get this out? Out of here. I think I gotta kill myself. Actually, am I stuck now? Maybe if I shoot it backwards? Okay, there we go. If I can get it up here, if this weighs more than the prince. If this is what I need to solve another puzzle? Much further? No, I need it for this one. Okay, I think I know what I need it for. Alright. And then I need to turn to wolf. Hop up here. Send this flying. Oops, the rock fell on your head. You alright, blind prince? Uh, the brain damage is starting to get to him. Alright, there we are. Whoops. Okay, that's an interesting mechanic. Let's hope we're fine, though. Uh, this looks like a long fall. We're not... We're obviously not gonna die, but... Seems like a bad fall. Even if you fall on highs, please. It'll be okay if you land on a mushroom. Good to know, good to know. Uh, let's see. What's this way? Alright. So first is you. Oh god, there's so many of them. My, there's, oh, okay, so this is just an infinite pit of them, isn't it? Yeah. Alright, maybe I can get around. Wait, can I fall, can the wolf fall from a high place? Or is it, like, different rules? Like, it's gotta be much higher for him. 
Or her, my bad. Cut these guys in half. I hate these things. Routine Hunter. Nice. Alright, let's see. So it's this way. Okay, this is the exit. Interesting. So then the other way is what exactly? Rincy, you stay there. A platforming puzzle. With just one of those. Okay, wait, I can't see anything over there. Ooh. Come on. So let's figure out how we're gonna do this exactly. Because I think if I hop up here... Ouch. Yep. I'm so sorry, babe. Let's go over here. Uh, okay, I thought I did it again. Ah! We both died. Great, 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 great. We're doing great so far. Uh, clearly, clearly perfecting our, uh, our little routine we've got going on. Alright, come on. Alright, one last time. Dang it! At least he fell on the mushroom. Or, I guess, not enough to kill himself. Nope. Alright, let's fall again. <sighs> lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely! You two make a lovely couple, don't you? Alright, scout out the area. Do this thing. This flower seed's strong it's attack in wolf form. Okay, interesting. I'm assuming this is gonna be a boss mechanic. Because I think there's bosses in this game. Mm, 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 mm. All right, let's go. And we're dead. Yep. Dang it. <laughs> uh, I keep miscalculating things. Just kill it. Thank you. It won't kill Prince if I put him in front of it, will it? I mean, I'm not gonna try it. Oh, I lost him. Where'd I lose him? I lost him all the way back there. I didn't jump. Come on, babe. I gotta get better than this. Dun -dun. Hmm. Alright, so far so good. Ouch. But still fine. <laughs> Who's that girl? Well, I'm... She saved my life. But I'm also the most bruised I've ever been. Oh, dang it. I keep miscalculating, please. Uh... Alright, come on. Let's move. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> oh, thought I missed it. Ah, I wish I didn't take like the fall animation every time I did one of those. Uh, is, there's nothing like higher up here, is there? Or, like at least up here. Yeah, no. Come on, get the bounce. There we are. Actually, I could have stayed wolf. For like a hot second. It sounds like a cell phone now, almost. I mean, I dig it, but like, I understand the like very calm, serene jungle vibe it's going for. 
So wait, is this attack stronger than my claws is what it's saying? Just be on the downward swing whenever I do it. Here we are. Alright, come on. We're going home. I'm sure we're getting close to something. Uh, let's see, is there anything I can do over here? Other than kill you. Okay, wait. Uh, quickly become a princess. Uh, let's get out of here. Alright, and then kill these things. They almost... They have a weirdly Pokemon-esque look to them. I don't know if that was intentional. Uh, there's gotta be a flower around here somewhere, right? Kinda just scouting out the area ahead. At least for now. Uh, okay, there's plenty of things over here. Let's see... Uh, ooh. I think that's a flower. Yeah, that's a flower. Uh, how do I activate that? There's a lever somewhere. It's a lever. Or maybe it's that other button over there, and they both do it. Okay, I think I we have to jump. Okay, I have to wait for a good time, then head down, because I think there's a mushroom down there. Can you... Oh. oh, wait, can I... Oh, dang. I didn't... Huh. Okay, wait, maybe I can kill that one specifically? I don't know. Oh, dang it, I have to do that one puzzle again. Alright, let's do that. Actually, wait, I wonder if... If I go ahead real quick, if that's something that brings down the lever. Or like it's up till that thing's hit. No? Okay, sometimes they do that. There's more puzzle I can actually solve on here. Uh, okay, nothing like that. Nope, that's exiting. Okay, cool, cool, cool. I got a good beat of what's going on then. So if I... Mm. Ouch. So if... Okay, uh, I'm still confused on what I'm supposed to exactly be doing. Wait, is there a lever? Oh. Yeah, you're not killing me, buddy. Is he... Is he just... Kind of... You're not gonna kill me. No. Okay, there's no lever there. Uh, is there a lever somewhere down here? No? Ah. Huh. I wonder where this lever is. Okay. So, cut this thing out. We got long arms. Also, this somewhat reminds me. Like, the length of our arms alone makes me think of Sonic, Hedgehog, and the Curse of the Werehog. Alright, come on. Here. Through here. Okay. So once it's behind me, we can continue moving. I think that's that's the play, right? I also don't think it can get us while we're here. Did that kill us? Oh, we should have just dropped down. Jumping gave us extra height that we didn't need. And that killed us. Okay, also, also noted. Uh, don't jump whenever you just need to fall down. Uh, it's, it's flaunty for no reason. One, get in. All right, here we are. So first, up over here. Do this little jump. He's coming back this way. All right, 
if I just fall, everything should be alright. Right? Okay, come on. Let's keep moving. Keep moving. Keep moving. Oh, no. Come on, buddy. Oh, okay. So, I'm assuming those, like, little hive-looking things are meant to signify that they kind of spawn in that area. Uh, let's see. Mushroom? Yes, mushroom bed. Very nice. I saved. Ouch. We, we, we're, in, we're in a world of hurt right now. <laughs> or at least our husband, though, is. Uh, oh, okay, wait. So let me do this real quick. I'll hop off this. If I tell him to move forward, I can be on this side. There we go. Now we're thinking with portals. Uh, okay, how far off was I? So not far. So I need you to be a little more over here, I think. This should be fine. Whoops. I keep forgetting what buttons do. Honestly. It's also nice that that... Okay, yeah, that was right. Transform. Oh! Ooh! Okay, first, let's get this lever hit. There we go. Perfection. Alright, head backwards. There we go. Alright. Pick us another flower. Pick us another. Ooh, hello, Ursa. How you doing today? <laughs> Thank you, man. I appreciate it. <laughs> Glad I can get that opportunity. Ah, all right. Let's see. My little flower boy. I'm doing real good, doing real good, man. Enjoying this adorable little game so far. Uh. Oh no. Uh. Hubby. Oh no. <laughs> I think I messed up. I royally screwed up. Uh. Yep, okay. Stale Brains. Hi, how are you doing, man? I need to die. <laughs> Kill me. Kill me. My love awaits! Thank you! Hi, how are you doing today? Ooh, thank you for the follow, man. I appreciate it. How are you doing today? Uh, okay. Okay, good, good. We didn't lose much progress. Oh, wait. Uh, or really any at all. Uh, I just kind of got to set him back over here. Oh, come on. Come on. Head that way. Hey, up here. How are you doing today? And... Thank you, Ursa Mina, for stopping by. I appreciate it. It's chilling. So late at night. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Get this. Uh, yes, 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 yes. Alright, I need to get Husbando off that button. So I can actually bring him the flower. Oh no, I died. I killed myself. Of course I can. <laughs> Fall damage is something I don't remember at all in this game. I, I hate it. I hate it, but I know it's a necessary thing. This isn't far enough, is it? I don't think so. Yeah, no. Come over here. Ugh. I'm such a scrub. Perfect. Alright, and then... Ah, oh, dang it. Don't laugh at me. I'm just a silly boy. Need to get... Alright. That should be good. It has bon Now, fall damage is not a thing when you're a wolf, and that's what I'm constantly forgetting. Really. Uh, okay. Jeez. It's such a cool trick that you can do as well. Because if I'm holding the flower, 
or if he's still on that button and the wall's down, I die if I fall. So it's a... Uh, it sucks. <laughs> but now I can bring him his little flower. Like the cute little princess I am. And not a ver... A ferocious carnivore which blinded... Blinded my boy. Here. Here, babe. Have a flower. And he loves me more. And I've never felt so loved. I'm gonna cry a little bit. It'll be like my second time crying on stream. So sad. Da -da, da -da. Uh, alright. Darkness fell. The witch's house was still. Relatively far away, they began searching for a place to speed, spend the night, spend, speed the night, spend the night. After wandering for a bit, they found an unstable cabin that was covered from top to bottom with mushrooms. How far away is this, like, trip to the witch's house because it seemed like she made it in a day and we're gonna be here for a long time. <laughs> it's pretty rickety. Maybe we could stay for just one night, the princess said anxiously. The firmly held hands. They firmly held hands and entered the cabin. By the way, this is a very lewd game. They just keep holding hands. Uh, the inside of the cabin was even dark. Hydrate, of course, uh, than the forest. Only a few blurred shadows were visible. The princess squinted her eyes to see what they were. Hmm. Yeah, luckily I have water next to me, so thank you for the hydrate. I actually got two bottles of water. Whoa, so many corpses, the princess said, realizing that the shadows- I can't believe this, not even an NSFW warning, SMH. I, I, I'm honestly surprised that Twitch has not banned me. Uh, that the shadows were dead goats. I'm sorry, those are what goats look like in your universe? <laughs> Th those are goats. Like, like billy goat goats or like goat goats? Uh, they have fungus growing out of them. What corpses the prince was stunned. Can he not smell them? Do they not smell at all? <laughs> nah. Perfect timing. I'm hungry anyway. Let's eat them for dinner tonight. What the prince believed that believing that the corpses were humans was taken aback by the prince's outrageous suggestion. The princess left the prince to his own confusion and decided to sample one of the goats. But just as the wolf's large fangs were about to sink into the goat's stomach, it let out a weak cry. The princess heard the groan and called out to her, Pri Princess, that human's still alive! The wolf clicked her tongue and reluctantly stopped. <laughs> Come on, bro. Nature's law was to eat weak prey after all. Come on, bro. I just wanted a snack, dog. Uh, she started at the pr stared at the prince, disappointed. So he thinks they're human beings. She thought. Guess I can't do anything about that. Poor, poor gal. The prince called out to the goats and listened to their story. The princess, these people are starving and can't move. Maybe we could help them. The wolf wanted to be closer to the prince, so she grudgingly agreed. They set out to find some food for the goats. <laughs> Babe, I just want to eat them, alright? Ooh, what's with these? What's with all these random chests? Is this my greed getting the better of me? I'm gonna get like a achievement for it, aren't I? Yeah. I I figured as much. Uh my greed immediately blinded me. I was like, kill everything in there. Also, I realize I just now realized that the stream avatars aren't going all the way through. One second while I fix that. Also oh god. This thing isn't exactly also full sized either. Adjusting it. Ah dang it. Uh, pull this one back quite a bit. One second. Uh, maybe I could 
left this one a little farther up. Alright, there we are. I actually can see the stream avatars, and then I need to also adjust the stream avatars because they're not fitting either. Oh god. Bad content, bad content. Alright. Ah, where were we? Alright, back to this. Uh, so I guess this, this is an immediate lesson on greed. Don't get greedy. I'm sorry. Here we are. Come on. I don't know why I did that. He was already on the second layer. Come on, Princey. Follow me. I'll kill this thing for us. Babe, don't worry. I'm a mass murderer. I do this for a living at this point. Do, 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 do. Kill that. Let's go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, alright. How many of these need to be a thing? Kill the heretics. Burn the heretics. Uh, ouch. You know, I'm surprised that this doesn't have any effect on him if, as I'm sure, yeah, it barely misses his head. As well as this clawing I'm doing. Alright. Alright, come on, babe. Oh, is it just gonna be slightly dipping? There we are. Burn the heretics. For they reject our love. Ah. Everything about this game is just about perfect for me. Puzzle, simplicity, also really just amazing. Filthy heron, yes, yes. You're in the spirit now, Ursa. Truly, truly a forsaken place is this. How did I not collect that? Uh, okay. Just... It's weird that there isn't a proximity rule for the prince and them. Because I feel like that'd make it a little more challenging to kill creatures, because I'd have to bring him a little closer every time. Uh, I grab one of these. I don't know what I'm collecting the leaves for, but I'm collecting them. Oh, shoot. I almost left the prince behind. Jump on these. Oh, fling, flung him up there without... Me? Okay, let's, let's do some investigating, it seems. Gonna go up here. Ooh. Little does he know, I'm getting him a present for Christmas. Uh, everything else seems sound, actually. There's nothing else up here. How do I wait, how do I see uh, all the flowers? Oh, wait. Is that what I get for the flowers and all that? I'm assuming that's what I get for- Or no, that's what I get for all these. So the mole design. <laughs> oh my gosh, I haven't encountered those yet. Goats. Design is based on mountain goats that are carnivorous and have fangs. Oh, so goats are carnivores in this. Uh, brown might be good to have them slobbering mushrooms and mold grow on them. Dude, these design sheets are so good. Uh, trophies. How do I know? Wait, stage select. Do each of them these have a flower associated with them, or do some of them not? I wonder. If so, I've been missing a lot of flowers, and that's a little disappointing. But I think I've gotten all the flowers so far. I feel like I've explored it fairly well. Unless there's like a go back mechanic kind of deal we have to replay it <clears throat> we make weird foot noises sorry I, I i didn't mean to insult you babe but we make weird foot noises <laughs> uh all right no come on into this come on into the hole Oh my gosh. We're just gonna do this now. Because I can. Dun, 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 dun. Whew. Uh. <laughs> Babe, how did you... Oh, you hit air? 
Not even man enough to take air like a champ. I couldn't marry a person like that. My man has to live whenever he air hits him. It's a sad reality we live in, but this is women's standards now. Right, I can't transform- Height transformation. Interesting concept. I just get annoyed a little every time I see the animation. Like, just don't transform me. Come on. Rapid fire machine gun. Let's go. On the way down. I'm terrible with timing. So brute force it. Oh, come on. What the heck is it? There it is. Brute forcing. The only method I, I respond to at this point. Alright, let's get over here. Ouch, it hurts, but we're fine. Alright, let's actually do some more investigating. Kill you. Actually, wait, avoid fall damage. I need to, I need to start making this like a habit. So that I constantly think about not dying to fall damage. Hmm. Ouch. Okay. Let's get this. It's a good, good. It's good. Uh, let's see, what's over here? Some flower patch? They sound like Pokemon. I'm- it's weird, but they really do. Uh, what's all the way over here? Da, 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 da. All right, everything's good so far. Da, 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 da. All right, come on, boy. Hey, boy. Uh, let's see. Maybe there's a flower through here. Okay, wait. So I gotta tell him to walk forward. Oh, so that's where I see where how far he goes. Oh no 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 no! Oh. I fell on the mushroom, thank god. Uh, thank goodness for mushrooms. I, I don't know what I would have done if I did. I would have cried maybe a little bit. My prince would have never known how I've met my fate. Uh, okay, wait, check, make sure this thing doesn't respawn. No, it does not. Okay, we're good. You can leave now. Come on, boy. Hold my hand. We're halfway there. I'm living. Oh, we got the meat. They returned to the cabin with a lot of meat and gave it to the goats. I got a lot, the princess said proudly. Help yourself. They're gonna try to kill us, aren't they? The prince quickly intervened. Princess, wait, we haven't cooked the meat yet. Goats are monsters, so they love raw meat. But the prince still thought that they were humans. If I mention how monsters eat raw meat, the princess thought, he'll know I'm a monster. She decided to play along with his story. Are they gonna get mad that we ruined the meat? Uh, okay, um, we better cook the meat then, but I never made a fire before. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Does he think I killed all these creatures on my own? Just, just FYI, we carried all this meat and he, she's like, you're still human, clearly. Uh, so please teach me how to do it. She managed to avoid a potentially awkward situation. And drink again. Hmm. Another hydrate, my good friend. The princess tried to follow the prince's instructions to light the fire, but... Uh, no, I'm scared. The princess was still deathly afraid of fire. She began to cry and ask the prince for help. Uh, the prince wasn't confident that he could make a fire because of his blindness. But he was happy that she'd asked him for help, so he agreed. Okay, I'll give it a shot. The prince summoned a little courage for the princess. Uh, take the prince next to the lantern. Hold this. Can you hold this, babe? Oh wait, do I need to bring him closer? One. Is he not? Oh, no. What? Okay, there we go. Hold. Come closer. I think this is close enough. 
Grab it. If you place the lantern near the spot where the fire was gone out, you can place the fire again. Okay, so I can just walk him towards it. <laughs> the meat turned out perfectly. The goats were utterly delighted and immediately ate all of it. Cooked meat is amazing! Ma. Uh, thanks, you helped us, Ma. We almost starved to death, Ma. One of the goats said, thanking the two. I'm glad. Can we stay here tonight? The princess assessed. Uh, of course, Ma. It's a little dirty and overrun by mushrooms, though, Ma. The goats took them into their home. The long day finally came to a close. The prince was exhausted and dozed off. The nocturnal wolf could not sleep. The restless wolf wandered outside the cabin and found one of the goats chasing a rabbit. The rabbit ran swiftly and nimbly, and the goat was unable to catch it. Oh, hi, wolf. Hunting's hard, ma. You got so much meat in the blink of an eye. You're pretty good, ma. The goat said, innocently, praising the wolf's hunting skills. The wolf shrugged off the compliment. She was the, worried the prince would overhear the goat calling her a wolf. When she tried to cut the conversation short, Oh, that human is the emergency rations, ma. The goat asked frankly, which started the wolf. Not a bad idea. Maybe we start doing that so we won't starve again, ma. Uh, but if I were you, I'd get a fatter human. He's so skinny, he might be a midnight snack, ma. I kill him. Normally, the wolf would engage in his banter as eating humans was common amongst monsters, but now that she was traveling with the prince, she became alarmed at the ghost's words. Hydrate again? But no, the prince isn't like that. The wolf inadvertently denied. <laughs> Baka! The wolf! <laughs> ah, so you're in love with a wolf. Baka! No, I'm not. I can do this all day. I'll hydrate anytime. Uh, didn't let her blunder go unnoticed. Could it be you want to get along with humans, Ma? The wolf knew the goat and knew the truth, but she refused to admit it and kept quiet. You know it's impossible for monsters and humans to get along. It sounded as if she couldn't be friends with the prince. The wolf opened her mouth to speak, but no words came out. You heard of it too, don't you, Ma? Monsters gobbling up humans? Humans killing monsters? Ma? The wolf hung her head as the goat continued. No. Good will come from this, Ma. But you did save us, so if it's something you really want, I'll support you. Good luck, Ma. The goat returned to the cabin. The wolf curled up and tried to sleep as the goat's words replayed endlessly in her mind. She felt uneasy. Up until then, she'd been happy to hold the prince's hand as the princess, believing there was nothing to fear. But her wolf form was a monster that the prince hated, and he still didn't know that she was the one who blinded him. If he ever found out... She wouldn't know what to do with us. It'll be okay, the wolf told herself. If I can just keep this up a bit longer. She didn't sleep that night. The next morning. The princess and the prince left the cabin. The ghosts thanked them again and prayed for their safe travels. Good luck, Ma. Don't eat him by accident, said the ghost the wolf had talked to the night before. The prince didn't understand, but she said, what but she did i won't eat him the princess thought needing to calm her anxious heart she pulled the prince's hand and set off again eat up goats come on buddy let's go uh more adventures away it seems that the prince can hold the stone wait why would i need him to hold the stone though he has to be directly on top of it okay this is gonna be messy situation for a bit. Dun, 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 dun. 
Alright, come on. Best and place it with the... Uh, wait, I thought we established what to do with it. Oh wait, do I have to... Do I have to... Why would I need him to do that, though? Wait, okay. Here's the question, though. What happens if it's off? Yeah, I get two of these. Why would I... Why would I do it any other way? Come on, buddy. Let's keep going. Alright. Let's try this. Uh, I guess this is what it's good for. For him picking this up. And then me kind of like us carrying on like this and he still jumps dude he's strong he carries that stone like a champ oh, come on set the stone down hubby oh, whoops. <laughs> uh, also wait there's something over here i hope he doesn't die off screen while i'm doing this checking this side out uh there's this i don't know what that leads to oh wait perhaps i can do this because i bet this opens up if i don't have that on no actually it does not what's the secret here Where's my... Where's my stuff? I demand... I demand goodies. I want that flower for my boy. This Bondo deserves flowers. Alright, let's keep going, babe. Actually, wait. I wonder if it's up here. Okay. Uh... Ooh! Uh, I'm gonna go to sleep now. You too, man. Uh, thanks, I appreciate it. Hope you have a wonderful night. husband off this. Appreciate it, appreciate it. Ah, uh, 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 what happened? What? No, what? I wanna... What? Whoa. That sent me way back. Ouch. Well, not way back, but, you know, back enough. Alright, right. off we go, come on. I want to hold them. I want like a plush of them. Or I want a plush of the wolf, maybe. I wonder if there was such... Because I remember this was like a PS Vita thing, and then it... I think it's out now on Switch, which is why I have it. And I was stoked because I was like, oh, this was a like it was positive a PS Vita exclusive. So glad I could experience it though. Da, da, da. Uh let's see. Let's see. Uh what's no, nothing's over here. Okay, dang it. I don't know why I did that. Uh, nothing can comes of that. Alright. <laughs> nope. Nope. Should not have done that. Should not have done that. Ooh. Okay. Ooh, sick movement. My movement's on fire. Oh wait, quickly grab this. Uh or this takes off. So it looks like everything's clear from here, right? Because if I go this way, or I try to do that, nothing comes of it. So let's take our boy. Ah, okay. Ouch. 
I made a mistake. Um, here we are. Lovely, lovely, absolutely delicious. This is a power couple if I've ever seen one. Alright, crush this. Come on. Ah. Ooh, whoops, okay. Let's not try anything rash. Uh, let's see what's going on. So let's see what I'm do up against. Let's see all the way over here. This. Okay. Now, so that means nothing. I shouldn't try to do that so far. Uh, all right. Anything else I'm looking for? Oop. No, nothing over there. Uh... Okay. I still don't know how to get that flower is the thing. Alright, uh... Jump to wolf. Right, uh, no, Prince, Prince, d careful. Careful, my love. Ah, this is such a nice scene. Ah, uh, okay. Right. So, let's see. If I stand on this... A and B is so weird for this. Oh, wait. Okay, I can jump from here to here. Mm. Uh, Alright, grab this. Right, that still counts. Oh, uh... Come on. Let's get you a little closer. This is as close as I can get you right now. Can you lift it? There we are. Oh, woo! Yep, that was death. I, I was not thinking that was death. Alright, uh, okay. Not that hard. sure if I get him off here. Mm. Actually, what do- I... oh wait, do I have to get him to hold it down? Oh shoot, did I actually lock myself? Oh shoot, I totally locked, didn't I? Oh no! Time to die. Also, did I... Did I really skip past the flower? Or is there like a different way I'm supposed to get it? <laughs> oh, she looks so sad as she falls. Oh, wait. Prince, come on. Here. Oh. Okay, back here. Mm -mm 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 -mm. 
Alright, pick this up. Alright. Set it down over here. Uh, I come over here. Oh wait, I can just smack it over here. Oops. Ooh, I almost went too far. Okay, there we go. Now we're playing with portals. Uh, is it going to do the saving thing, or am I going to have to... I missed a flower. Uh, that's actually going to bother me. Yeah, that's it. Okay, wait. Can I go back? Oh god, no. Can't. I'm going to try to redo the stage. I don't know if it saves your progress after you finish it. I don't think it was that far till it, was it? I hope not. Okay, wait. Stage select. Okay, yeah. Ooh, I don't... okay, so I haven't been missing any. So that was the only one I was missing. Wait, do we even need that? Whoops. Oh, yeah, we did. Uh, okay. Grab this. Man, he he's strong. He's thin, but he's strong. <clears throat> Alright. So let's see. Yeah, okay, it's just over here. So it's literally like five steps away. So what do I need over here? Uh... Looking for something. No. Maybe when this is open. Is that it? Oh, I, I guess I can't hit it very well over gaps, can I? So that's kind of the point of him grabbing it. Mm. Alright, set it down. And I don't think that opens it, does it? Transform. No. But... What does this do? Can I fall in here? Curious. Okay, that's what that does. But we found out the like little secret. Okay, so if I grab, grab the rock over here, buddy. Alright, come on. Alright, uh, drop the rock for me. Alright, here's your flower. Oh, and there's another stone. Okay, do I even have to finish the level, I wonder? I don't know if it... Let me just give him the flower. The flower? Yay! He loves it! Uh, now check if that counts. Yes, it does. I'm not. Wait, I missed. I missed two petals. I'm not gonna go for those. I'll do that in my own time. But the flowers seem very important to me. Uh, hello, dark void of the abyss. Okay. This music's so good. Ah, yeah. oh, these designs. I can't kill it. How do I get up there?
Uh, okay, interesting. Okay. <laughs> the wolf scream. <laughs> Her scream whenever she sees what happens to him is uh, a little eerie. Okay, I'm given like five seconds before it returns to that form. I like that. I like that mechanic. It's like booze, but different. Ah, oh, dang. I wish I had sprung for this. I think I don't have the soundtrack. Uh, okay, what happens if I drop from here? Ooh, what? Assuming they kill husband, but... Wait. So it still transforms? But I have to look it in the eye. Okay, that's different. Also, I saw a drop-off point where I can do this. Try this quickly. Ooh, did I miss a pedal? I think I missed like a pedal back there. Then again, this whole level is out of order, so it wouldn't make sense if I'm gonna see it again. Oh, nope, we got them all. There's no flower here either. At least, not according to the thing, I don't think. Hmm. Oh my gosh. What are you guys doing here? Get out of here. Oh, what happens if I head down here? Ah. Uh, uh. Where am I? Dude, I, I'm in love with this music. Alright, come on. Oop. Oops. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Shit, baby. I'll treat you right. Ooh. One and two, two and three. Three and one unless you cross them. The road will not open. This mysterious row. So wait, there's a mysterious... So one and two, two and three, three and one. So three, five, four. Three, five, four, is that it? Ooh. Okay, three, five. No. So is it four, five, three? Uh, jeez. Alright, there's a mysterious row of crystals. Let's have the princess approach them and touch it. Mm. Unless you cross... Unless you cross... Wait, what? So is it... Is it... One... One... Two? Seven? Like cross is it no it's is it by multiplication then? So is it two six one uh, two six three? I don't what it means by cross exactly. Two six three. Okay, yeah, actually it didn't mean multiply. Cool. Then I like the little pumpkins. Dun, dun, dun. 
Surprised we haven't encountered any boss like entities. At dusk, they found a lake. In. Uh, they found a lake in the middle of the forest. The scarlet sunset reflection danced brilliantly on the lake surface. The area appeared safe, so they decided to stay there for the night. After dinner, they spent some more time talking. You read a lot of books, don't you? I like the books with games you play with others. Or really, what's that like? The prince was delighted that she was interested. So he happily explained one of the game's rules. So, there's a winner and a loser, okay? Let's play, the princess said eagerly. Oh, and let's make it so that the loser has to grant the winner's wish. The prince added. Alright, I'm not gonna lose, said the princess, haughtily feeling that she, like she'd already run. Or heartedly. I lost, the princess clenched her teeth, blinking back tears. <laughs> so she's a sore loser. You know a lot of words that I don't. <laughs> I read a lot of books, the prince said, sheepishly grinning. Um, since I won, can I tell you my wish? Oh, e yeah, the princess was still upset at losing. But she regained her composure and waited for the prince to speak. Princess, I really want to hear you sing, the prince said shyly. Uh, what, sing? The singing voice, which the prince had come to hear every night, had been given to the witch in exchange for turning her into a princess. She hadn't sung once since they'd started traveling together. It was hard to imagine what her singing voice was like now. I love your singing voice. Um, the prince thought long and hard. If I don't sing, will he no longer trust me? She felt pressured. Okay, I'll do it. The prince nervously cleared her throat, opened her mouth, and started singing. But her voice was nothing like her own. In fact, it was horrible. The prince looked blank. She sounded completely different from what he remembered. The prince started cough. Pr Sorry, I guess I'm exhausted from all this traveling. I'll sing again after I've rested. Oh, no, I'm sorry I forced you to sing. We should sleep early so you can rest. The prince's gentle words cut into the princess, who felt guilt for lying about her voice. Dawn arrived. The prince was in a deep slumber, but the wolf remained unable to sleep. Slow. She slowly walked around the lake, her head buzzing with anxiety. It's impossible, impossible for monsters and humans to get along. The goat's words were played endlessly in her head. I need to stay in princess form, the wolf thought. I can't be pr with the prince unless I keep lying. She felt conflicted about her feelings for the prince and her constant lies. The wolf prodded the lake's surface as if to erase her uneasiness. The water slowly rippled. The wolf glanced at it and saw her monstrous reflection. It's weird how her eyes are actually like normal, but the art style has it on like a flounder-esque, like one side of the face. Uh, what part of the stage select am I in? Because I'm thinking now might be a good time. Yeah. We'll end it for eat for tonight. So, actually. Save. Alright. So, thanks so much for watching. Hope everyone has a wonderful night. And thanks for sticking around. Corpse. Out.